It's January 19th, 2013, and I'm in the uh, garage working on the coolant flow testing again. Uh, the reason being is I took the Tormach nozzle and I modified it by removing the uh, flow control valve and just made it so it was a straight shot. I didn't need a flow control valve here and it would provide a little bit of a restriction, so I figured I'd remove it. So the size difference between the two is pretty substantial. This is the loose one I'm holding on the left is a uh, quarter inch uh, lock line uh, size connection and then this one I, I'm guessing is half inch judging by the fitting size. I haven't actually seen a, a half inch on the market in person so I don't know for certain that that's the right size but that's what I'm speculating it is. So I'm going to run a flow test with the uh, front two nozzles closed and see what the flow rate is through the uh, larger half inch diameter nozzle to see what the difference is and what sort of restriction the quarter inch lines provide. So the tip on the end is the same diameter. You notice I don't have a right angle head here so I may have to make some uh, either some assumptions or some uh, do some comparison tests by putting the straight nozzles on these to see what the actual flow difference is since I'm uh, doing a little bit of an apples to oranges comparison. But I figured it would be worth it, the test and see how it went. Now for a test run close up to get see, be able to see into the bucket uh, when the flow is coming out. You can see that the seal on the fitting isn't the greatest back there. Leaking a little bit. No problem really. And that's two gallons. And that quickly, see how much air is in there. It'll clear up in just a second. And just for comparison's sake, since I did essentially the same thing the other day, actually let me uh, get the coolant out of this bucket so I don't run low in the reservoir. And this is a single nozzle by itself, demonstrating its flow rate. To round out the single nozzle flow testing, what I've done is switch back to the quarter inch hose with a straight tip on the nozzle here rather than a 90 degree tip. Again, the outlet is uh, one quarter inch as I've used with all the tests. Uh, the outlet on the nozzle is one quarter inch. So what I've decided to do, since I did this previously, I now know what a 90 degree nozzle flows like on a quarter inch hose. I know what a straight nozzle flows like on a half inch hose and I'd like to find out what a straight nozzle flows on the quarter inch hose and that's what I'm here to do. So the uh, testing will begin now.